2002, 20 years ago. At 29 years old, the Harveys arrived in Raleigh with three young children, Nathaniel, Anna, and Benjamin. God brought them from another church in a small North Carolina town to lead Raleigh First Assembly of God. They came with years of Baptist ministry experience blended with a Pentecostal heritage. I told Darla, I said, worshiping like this, the freedom in worship, the music, I said, honey, there's no way we can ever go back. It, it blessed my heart. That's what we've come here for, is to lift up Jesus Christ, to praise His name. Today, the Cross Assembly family wants to celebrate Pastor Chad and Darla's 20-year anniversary of faithfully serving our church, community, and pockets of people worldwide through global missions. Their passion as leaders in missions and as parents is admirable. Thank you for allowing us to celebrate your children's birthdays, graduations, weddings, and partnering with you as parents to disciple your children. Do you covenant? to reaffirm your calling to a place of service in this church under the leadership of Pastor Harvey, to pray for and love him and his family, and to give all diligence to serve the Lord and this church with faithfulness and with excellence. We rejoice with you that you've also added two daughter-in-laws and a son-in-law to your family. Thank you for the tremendous steps of faith you led us to take with the Sudan Challenge in 2006. We raised over $1 million in a year to build a school, women's center, and an adult English language center in the predominantly Muslim country's capital of Khartoum. Why? So people could hear about Jesus. Another step of faith was moving from our Blue Ridge Road location to temporary use of North Raleigh Christian Academy to an outdoor tent, then into our completed current location at Yonkers Road. We also want to say thank you for standing firm in your spirit-led convictions to remain open during the pandemic. Our church did not compromise to the fear-based demands of cultural mandates in these tumultuous times. Instead, we became a place of refuge for many people seeking a church where they could gather and worship together. Additionally, we opened a second campus during the pandemic. We thank you for living out 1 Thessalonians 2.8 by loving this church and people by sharing the gospel in your lives with all of us. We are so grateful to you for leading us boldly and courageously over the last 20 years. We look forward to many more. Hey, Chad and Darla, 20 years, man, it doesn't seem possible. Every time I've been with you multiple times on missions, emphases, mostly, of course, on Faith Promise Sunday, it's been such a joy to be with your wonderful congregation. Their, your leadership there has been a spark to incredible ministry all over the world. Not only do you have a huge heart for the lost and the suffering, but you have a great head for the strategic investments that really establish the church among all peoples everywhere, which is really the heart of our mission. I can't adequately express to you on behalf of Greg Mundus and the, the executive committee our joy at your 20 years and our gratitude for your generosity. Speaking of your generosity, I recently got my uh, uh, cross assembly cap to replace my old RFA cap that I wear when my hair's messed up. But uh, so I'll put that on before I say goodbye. And I'll also say hats off to Chad and Darla and cross assembly at this incredible milestone. God bless you. Love you.